Hello, and welcome back to me, not doing Cube World. Um, you'll notice that I'm not in the field anymore, which is where I quit last time. Uh, and that is because I have found out something new about the game, and I'm going to share that with you right now. I, I jumped through time, and I went ahead and collected the stuff that I needed to collect to do this. Um, in, in mines, you'll find... Uh, shafts, and you'll find some some stuff to mine. You'll find iron, gold, and emerald. Uh, that that's what I've found thus far. And you can use that iron to craft things. You can also use the iron to let's put this shield here. You can also use the iron to like upgrade your current equipment. If you just attach these iron cubes to like the shield. Um, so I'll go ahead and do that. I'll make. I'll make some smiley faces. Or I'll attempt to make a smiley face. And there we go. Wonderful. That's my standard in battle. Is It's a little off-center. Um, that's all right. We'll deal with it. <laughs> you can also put it on, like, swords. This is... We'll do this sword. I'll be able to equip this sword after we level up, I believe. So we'll twirl that around. We'll make this a... Make this a broad sword, so we'll just even out these cubes here if we can. Maybe we can't. There we go. There we go. We'll make it a broad sword. We'll even it out. To turn it on its side here like that. There we go. There we go. There we go. We've got a few more cubes, so we'll use them on the shield. We'll give our smiley face... Oh, let's click the cubes again. Give our smiley face longer eyes, and there we go. Now we're out of cubes. So that's that done then, and what that'll do is that'll upgrade my my equipment just a little bit. Now, I don't know why it's not. Did I put the? Oh, I put the. Sm <laughs> I put the smiley face on the back of the shield. Um, <laughs> whoops. That's all right. He just stares at me ominously now. Uh, another thing that that I and. From what I can tell, I didn't really try it out, but from what I can tell, wizards and rangers will use wood to upgrade their weapons in that way, uh, with rogues and, and warriors using iron. And then the, the gold and the emerald that you'll get will just be used in uh, crafting recipes. But the next thing I want to do is another thing that I figured out. Every now and again, mobs will drop these leftovers. If you take these leftovers... Um, to an identification person such as this and then just put it there or maybe not right click it there we go and then identify it'll identify it for you and then you'll get an item and there i got an undamaged iron longsword which i can't use so that is no help to me at all just a few things that i learned just recently that might improve my game uh let's go over to this quest maybe we can do this quest before we take on the ruins of our core let's see here our goal here, we need to level up, we need to be able to equip that sword, and then we need to get to the runes of Aryukor and take it down. And hopefully that upgrading my equipment like that will help us out. So let's move on. I don't know if these witches here... Yeah, they're good. They're nice people. I collected a whole bunch of pumpkins, if you can see down there in my combat log, or in my action log, I guess, because it doesn't really log combat. Let's see, are we heading the right way? Then we'll kill things on our way. Is this lizard man? He's a nice man. Thought maybe he was staring at us funny. But no. He was staring at us funny because he's attracted to us. That's what I got from that. Let's see here. And this shield, that actually, that I have now is a shield that I crafted. It just took, a. Uh, it took some iron and it took some emerald to be able to craft that. And like I said, if I run into any mines, I'll go into them and I'll show you what the what the minerals look like and stuff like that. But they're scattered all around. They're a little hard to miss. And usually you can find bats in there and stuff. We'll get this ginseng. Might need it later. Doesn't look like I'm doing too much extra damage, but the extra damage might help. These lizard men, they're probably not nice, but I don't think I even want to try. Yeah, I don't even want to. I don't, <laughs> don't want to deal with it. I'll find people who are alone 
which I may not be able to do if I'm coming over here to this quest. Let's see here. Up the mountain. And there's absolutely nobody around. Those insect guards over there, I know I can't take them out. Let's, let's pick on this cat. Get out of here. I don't know where Sheep is. Sheep's just left us high and dry to deal with this cat. Who is kind of doing a good amount of damage to us. We've also, we need to start um, thinking about what, what I should have done back there in that city. Is I should have put uh, some equipment on. I should have bought some equipment. But that's alright. Because as it stands right now, I think I have iron boots and iron shoulder um, equipped. We should have bought some more. That's alright. We should be able to deal with it. Not the ruins of Aryakor, but some more ruins. Is that... Are you nice? No. And there's one of them. If I don't have to take on all these bats as well. Bats um, are a good indication that you're near a mine. Because they kind of hang out in there. I don't know if it's called a mine or not. Right there's the iron deposit. I don't know if it's called a mine or not. But I'm going to call it a mine from now on. Eat our pineapple slices. Get some health back. We're almost at the point now where we need to start making different foods. Because this is taking a little bit of time. Let's go ahead and take out this goblin. She doesn't even see it coming. Well, this is going pretty well for me. Usually humanoids I don't do too well on. But we're blocking well. And we took her down. Wonderful. Didn't get very much XP for it, but that's alright. Get these iron deposits. Deal with bats as well. So we can use those iron for equipment to make better equipment for us. We can also use the iron as I showed you for the for the crafting. So it's a good idea to collect all this stuff. I uh, I didn't in the past, but I'm gonna start collecting it now. Seems to be a much better idea than what I was doing. Get out of here, bats. Bats are easy prey. I feel like I feel like the the warriors, especially since I'm sp specialized as a guardian, I feel like my block should be a little bit better. I I don't know. Getting hit once by by one of those bats took my health down or took my block down to empty. But that's all right. I don't want to complain anymore. <laughs> Go ahead and make these muffins. But now, can't we just make muffins in peace? How was I harming you? Well, not getting very good blocks in. It's a little hard sometimes to... Uh... Wow. It saved what I was making. That was pretty cool. It's a little hard sometimes to guess when enemies are going to attack, but that's man, that's the case with any kind of hack and slash. All right, let's check out what are you, what is this place called? If you can see on the mini map there, the the boss is just right under me, but I need to find the entrance to the actual castle. Jed, Jed Jedden, <laughs> Geddon, Geddon Castle. I don't know how that would be pronounced, but. We're going to try to defeat the ruler. Hopefully this place isn't as hard as the ruins of Aryakor. Castles, I think, are usually... When a, when a place is called a castle, I think it's orcs that inhabit it. Yep. I was right. <laughs> eat some of this pumpkin muffin, and then we'll try to take them on. I don't know, there are three right there in the door, and we don't have sheep with us anymore. Didn't mean to rhyme, but I'm glad I did. Sheep is off having adventures of her own. Just continuing to eat pumpkin muffins. Let me see if I can call her to me. There she is. <laughs> Don't know where she was at. Alright, let's try to get these orcs. Try to pull them against the wall here. Let's see what we can do. Hold an ogre as well. Which the ogres in the dungeons are a lot uh, lower level than ogres that are outside of the dungeons. We're not going to be able to. We pulled too many. Yep. Dang it. Let's try again. I 
I think we might be able to... I think we, we were doing okay. We weren't doing the greatest. But we were doing pretty good. So, let's head back. Let's try it again. Let's try not pulling that ogre this time. Let's also try to take him a little bit further away. I was kind of just right outside the door with him. That means I'm going to have to dodge a little bit for the ranged characters. Come on. Up. Well, they're hitting sheep. Here we go. We'll pull them right over here at this corner. I don't think the ogre's on me. Nope. And here's the melee orc. Let's try to do as much damage as we can to this thing. There we go. Doing, doing okay. Now we need to really focus on these range guys. Well, they're just, they'll just tear us up from back here. Not doing too horribly. Doing pretty good. Trying to block as much as we can. Oh, we might get one of them. We got one of them. I'll take that. I'll call that a win. Oh my gosh. We're not going to be able to go one at a time, though. That'll take way too long. Um, I think I'm going to try one more time. If we can't pull it together this time, then we're going to abandon Geddon Castle. Here, let's pull them. Wow, we should have pulled them right here the first time. This is a little bit better place. Alright, let's focus this one down a little bit. Block. Knock him down. Get this one. Try to block his special attack. Did that pretty well. Block special attack again. Go. Killed him before he could do it again. Now this one got to potion a little bit, but that's alright. Still took her down. Let's eat some more pumpkin muffins. That didn't go so bad. So it looks like <laughs> it looks like two at a time I can take pretty well, but three at a time. And I, I'll tell you, I might be able to take three at a time down if there isn't a wizard in the mix. But wizards, they do so much damage. They're so they're so tough right now. Um, what should I do here? Let's see if I can pull this ogre. Nope, he's gonna. It's gonna pat, it's gonna pat back to those guys. This game makes me feel like I'm playing WoW again. Just with the words that I get to use. Pat, aggro. <laughs> oh, there we go. Blocked a special attack and knocked him down. Oh, blocked a special attack again. We're doing pretty good with this guy. Oh, didn't block that one. That's all right. Wow, we should have waited a little bit. That's all right. Oh, wow, didn't block his special attack again. And I can't seem to knock him down for whatever reason. Ah, and he got us. Oh, ogres are tough. All right. Well, let's just start grinding again. Because <laughs> clearly we're not cut out for dungeons yet. We really need to upgrade our weapons, and we really need to get some equipment. Oh, these alpacas. These guys are going well. Killing them by the handfuls. It humanoids in this game are always way stronger than anything else. I don't know why that's the case really, but they are always way stronger. Especially like I was saying, the wizards. This guy's a wizard. Let's try to take him down. Knocked him down. That was pretty well. And done. Got him pretty pretty okay. It's it's really hard. The rogue defensive uh, specialization, uh, the way that the rogue blocks is every time they use their ability, their their mouse two button or their one through three, which I need to be using my one more often. I need to remember to do that. But every time the rogue uses an ability, uh, they dodge, and they dodge for the entire time that they're using the ability. So they're... Mouse 2 for a longsword makes them kind of dash, and they do uh, they hit three times while they're dashing. And so, you know, for about three seconds... Ah, I totally muffed that up. So for about... Block this. There we go. For about three seconds, they're immune to damage, which is not very comparable to what the warrior can do for his block. So what do we got here? Crossbow? Nah, can't use that. How we looking? We're a little more than halfway. 
not going too bad. We need to... Oh, let's take down all these onionlings. They should be real easy. We need to uh, level up as quickly as possible. So we can use that new weapon that we just got. Get out of here. You guys are weaklings. I say that, and they're probably going to kill me. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. There we go. And another thing I should mention, I just saw one of them drop, drop it. Those little scrolls right here, they, uh... That's how you get your, um... Your recipes for crafting. The the shield that I have on right now actually came from a recipe from a bat when I was mining before I started recording. And, and they drop, they they drop fairly regularly. Good luck getting the one you want to drop though. <laughs> Which is kind of the this kind of the theme. And things I, I feel like uh, here I am complaining again. Don't mean to be doing that, but I'm going to. I, uh, I feel like things don't drop equipment as much as they should. And, I don't know, in any kind of hack and slash dungeon crawler, uh, I'm playing Torchlight 2 right now. I, I've had it for a long time, I just haven't gotten the chance to play it yet. Uh, but I'm playing it now. Um, and equipment drops all the time. And that's kind of how Diablo worked out, that's kind of how most dungeon crawler hack and slashes work out. It, I'm... Most MMOs work out that way, too. I'm going to try to take down these humanoids. They're too melee, so I should be able to do it pretty well. Um, I'll, even though this one's kind of rocking my world. I blocked a special attack. That was good. Didn't get to block that one. Oh, and that one's potioning. That one's potioning now, too. Let's block. We got one of them down. I don't know if we'll be able to take the other one down, because... I need to switch to my potion, but I, I can't because he's going to just destroy me if I do. Um, let's see here. Let's try to switch. Oh, switched. Just in time. Drink our potion. Can't believe we're wasting a potion on this guy, but I really want him dead. I shouldn't have blocked there. Uh, that's another thing. Like, it's... Oh, we got a new sword. That's pretty good. After I... Just mentioned that things don't drop as much as I'd like for them to. That's alright. Looks like we're kind of doing the same amount of damage. Um, but I, I feel like things don't drop as much as they should. Like I was saying, you take any kind of dungeon crawler or any kind of MMO or any kind of gear based, um, any kind of gear based game where getting gear and leveling up is kind of the point you know, gear drops all the time. And it, it's a good thing because I, I feel like when you do that, having such low drop rates like seems to be the case now means that I'm going to have to wait a while for, you know, something that's for a warrior to drop when there are four other classes that are dropping rarely. Um, when you've got a a system where things are dropping all the time, you're getting a lot of crappy stuff that you don't really need and you kind of just throw away anyways. But they have to have that kind of drop rate because you've got so many different classes that that stuff is dropping for. Oh, thank you, Liana. Appreciate it. She just reminded me that I need to be using my action skill more often. <laughs> or my button one. Ability. I don't know if I can take this Hornet on or not. I'm certainly going to try, but I don't know if I can do it or not. But, I, yeah, I didn't, didn't mean to complain. I did that last time, but I complained a little bit, so that's all right. But, yeah, it's still an Alpha. 98 damage. I should be using this skill more often, because right now I'm doing one damage to this thing. I, I was also going to mention... And again, I don't mean to complain, but I, with my block skill, the the damage I do is based on how much I charge it, which is based on how many um, MP I have down there. And I, I can't block as much as I would like because I have to charge up my MP if I want to be able to do damage as well. Yes. And... Maybe maybe it'll change a little bit for me once I get my one and two uh, one or my two and three abilities.
but as it stands right now, I don't really have all that many abilities that I can use aside from the ability that lets me block this squirrel. Am I going to get killed by a squirrel? Looks like it. Yep. Killed by a squirrel. All right. Well, that's where I'm going to end this video, I suppose. Killed by a squirrel. I'll, I'll be honest. I'm rage quitting. <laughs> that, that was annoying. All right. Well, thanks for watching. As usual, like and subscribe if you like. If you don't, nasty comment. You've seen these videos before, I, I, I assume. You know how much I do love those. All right. Thanks for watching. Bye.